90 Day Fiancé Before the 90 Days star Gino Palazzolo has finally revealed the real reason he wants Jasmine Pineda to sign a prenup before they get married. The 52-year-old Gino got engaged to 35-year-old Jasmine in Season 5 of the 90 Day Fiancé spin-off. It wasn't an easy feat for the couple since there had been relationship issues between them from the start. Jasmine demanded evidence and reports from Gino during their nine-month long-distance stint. She taunted him about his ex-wife and sugar babies and had a violent fight with Gino when she discovered he was sharing her private photos with a former girlfriend. Jasmine is waiting for her K-1 visa to be approved so she could move to the U.S. to stay with Gino, but she's also been reciting a long list of issues she has with him, including his lack of intimacy. In a preview shared by Jasmine herself for the upcoming episode, however, it's Gino's turn to talk about what bothers him about Jasmine. Yes, I love her but I've had fears about her temper since I've met her. Gino tells the producers while sitting inside Jasmine's bedroom. She overhears Gino and asks him to pack his things and get out of the apartment. No if you truly loved me, you'd listen to my proposal, Gino tells her. 90 Day Fiancé's Jasmine claims she's more attracted to her exes. Protection for Jasmine is the headline for the proposal he's written on a piece of paper. Gino talks about Jasmine being given the highest amount of financial protection if Gino were to initiate the divorce. Jasmine is not in agreement and proceeds to grab the paper and reads the rest of Gino's proposal to understand that if she initiates the divorce, she is going to get a very small amount. Jasmine rips the paper to shreds and asks Gino to leave her house. An infuriated Jasmine insults Gino by saying her ex-boyfriend is better looking than him, and that she's still attracted to him. And he has even more money than you. And he's young, and he doesn't have sex problems like you do, Jasmine says while walking away from Gino. Jasmine is yet to introduce Gino to her ex-boyfriend Dane who also happens to be her neighbor. In fact, Jasmine ended up moving into her new sea-facing apartment thanks to the Australian man. Jasmine admitted having split with Dane just after a few months of dating him because he was too plain for her. Jasmine craves drama in her life, and perhaps, these arguments with Gino fuel her. Except that Gino has grown tired of Jasmine's constantly berating and belittling him. Gino now wants to take charge. Gino asking Jasmine for the proper equipment to peel the potato when she asked him to do it was also a power move. Gino has had enough of Jasmine ordering him around and perhaps, fears that she will do so even when she moves into his Michigan home. Gino is possibly worried about Jasmine eventually stripping him of his life savings and leaving him once she gets a green card. There's more chaos in store for Gino and Jasmine on 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 days beyond the prenup and it remains to be seen if the couple will come to an agreement before Jasmine moves. Source, Jasmine Panama, Instagram.